The following video demonstrates the control process for the destruction of hydrocarbon vapors by a Falco catalytic oxidizer. Programming and treatment temperatures may vary with application. From a cold start, power is turned on and the dilution blower delivers air through the system at minimum speed. An air pressure switch enables the electric heaters. The T1 controller regulates the heaters, which warm the catalyst bed with hot dilution air. A minimum catalyst entrance temperature of 330C is reached and maintained by the T1 controller. The entire catalyst is heated to a level that will effectively destroy hydrocarbon vapors. Once the catalyst exit temperature T2 reaches 280C, the delivery of source vapors is enabled. Catalyst temperature increases with vapor concentration. A thermocouple installed in the catalyst, T3, provides rapid response to temperature change and early indication of increasing vapor concentrations. The T3 controller responds by increasing blower speed and dilution air to reduce and control vapor concentrations. If temperature ascent is too rapid, a rate alarm on the T3 controller increases blower speed to maximize dilution flow. The heat exchanger bypass valve begins to open as blower speed increases. This allows operation at increased vapor concentration by reducing heat recovered. Once the T3 rate alarm clears, the T1 controller gradually reduces blower speed and dilution flow to increase concentrations. As flow declines, the heat exchanger bypass valve closes to recover more heat from the exhaust stream. In the transition to steady state operation, blower speed is reduced slightly each time the heater cycles. By reducing blower speed, inlet concentration is increased, bringing heat recovery into balance with the heat required for preheating the inlet flow. If vapor concentrations are sufficient, all the heat required to maintain catalyst entrance temperature is supplied by the vapors and the heater load is reduced to zero. At low concentrations, flow and heater load decrease to the minimum necessary for complete capture and treatment. When process vapors are stopped, the blower slows down to minimum speed. As system enters standby mode, the heaters maintain the minimum catalyst treatment temperature. 